Oh, we just came from walking the dog. Good morning, good morning. I got a couple days done in here. Um, finish this one. I think I, I don't think I started this one. Maybe I finished this one with you. Never mind. Okay, that one was already done. That one was done. This is what I did. Something that turns or spins, this crazy lamp from Architectural Digest, a list, ephemera, an advertisement from a magazine where it's Carlton, graph paper or a portion of, this is a sticker from an ephemera pack, something that emits heat, a teapot from Architectural Digest, and pieces of washi tape. I just had one in my bag, so I just used that one. But I turned some people onto this. Um, something wet. Oh, a seashell. <laughs> Any kind of tag. I think I used this ticket from an ephemera pack. Pattern with stripes. These were all from a magazine. Something silver. This was from an ephemera pack. It's kind of black and white, but I'm choosing to believe it's silver. A barcode that came from a sticker magazine. An image from a magazine, Contents of July, which just happened to be in the month of July. But this came from these. I don't think I showed you these. These were a must-have thing on Instagram before I closed my account down because I'm still trying to get all these crazy people are hacking it. But it's complete and utter any kind of image on sticker paper. This one happens to be color-coded. Um, and I don't know where these come from. There's lots of Chinese writing on them. Made in China. I don't know any brand that might be on here. But these are great. And I don't think they were utterly expensive. And I think I got them through Amazon. Here's another brand. Or another one. I think it's the same. May not be. But this one has... A lot, but it has a lot of pre-done collages as stickers. See? Not unlike those little tiny um, tiny book things. But I really like that. But it has all kinds of stuff. And I've been getting some images. I don't want to focus. You know, this is real easy to pick out everything from here. I like I likes to make it mix it up. So, but my sister in law, who is an actual artist, she goes, "Oh, that's fantastic!" She goes, "This would be something." She's always trying to get me to teach other classes, teach classes. No, 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 no. She goes, "If the library will ever open up, which our gatherer of facts, whatever you want to call it, of the COVID numbers, we had twenty six thousand cases, new cases over." Saturday, Sunday, Monday, which was a holiday, and Tuesday. I think it was 96 people died. So it's averaging like 4,000 or 5,000, which is really high. My husband went somewhere last night with his man group, and I'm like, I really don't want you to. He said, we're eating outside. Oh, here's another one. Something that starts with the letter N, note, piece of a postcard, those two are from an ephemera pack. This is from, all of this was from an ephemera pack except for that and that. A piece of coloring book page, which I could not find one, but I found a sticker of a book. Measurement of something, even if you write it out. Well, here's a bunch of math on this sticker, so that worked for me. Something in a geometric shape besides triangle. Here's a circle. Milk label. Um, something that represents summer seashell and this is where I'm at today oh I love that one see what's underneath here is still beautiful something maroon graph paper origami or another kind of folded paper colorful paper a place a brochure portion of a brochure or advertisement okay that might be kind of easy but yeah we had a nice day at art yesterday um no new people but we had six, so that was good. And, and she set up card tables instead of our big tables. 
something maroon. Let's see if we can find that first. Oh. Oh, Skylar Hand Studio. Oh, this might be stuff from her, actually. I bet you it is, because she has a lot of this kind of stuff. Here's a portion of a brochure or advertisement. It's your cruise tag. Let's use that. I have to check these off because I get confused. The dog came back from the groomer. They messed up his haircut. But it'll grow back out. Oop, here's Scrooge and Marley. And little tiny circles. I didn't get into this set yesterday. There's a lot of Scrooge and Marley stuff left over in here from Christmas. And we're almost there. So yeah, our numbers are skyrocketing. And the lady that um, is new in our journal class, she was a retired, she is a retired physical therapist, but her, she just moved here from New York and her father died of COVID from being exposed at a nursing home. So in the last couple months, so she's not a fan of these ladies that say, oh, just take zinc, you'll be fine. It's not even real that are in our art group, which one of them was here, there yesterday. Okay, this could be a place, some crazy building somewhere. Okay, oh, this is another place. Oh, I think that's the Greek Orthodox Church in San Francisco. Hmm. Might want to do that. Oh, here's origami, but it's a butterfly made out of leaves. Can I use that? Origami are another kind of folded paper. It's folded leaves. Okay. Colorful paper. All these little stickers, circles, not stickers. That's washi tape scrap. Oh, here's maroon. Can that be maroon? Yep. I don't know if I have. Oh, here's. I don't know if I have graph paper in here. Oh, but I do know where I have some. Lots. Yeah. So I was telling my sister-in-law how I got out of kind of like my funk with this book. She said, oh, this book is fabulous. She loved it. Some more circles I might use. Okay, colorful paper. I think we could use this. And the lady um, that runs at rec center who I really like. Um, she made up a book and gave it to a friend of hers who absolutely loved it because she used things that reminded him her of him. And he's like, you were listening to me, <laughs> which I think is cool. Colorful paper. I've got that. Now I just need a place. Did I get a place? I think I got a place. I think I have it all. Let's move all this. I hate to cover all this up because it's so pretty. But these circles keep saying, we want to be used. All right. I want to cut this one. Some kind of fabric. Or ornamental thing. And our humidity is back for sure. Okay, let's go in order here. Something maroon, graph paper, origami or folded, colorful paper, this one, a place, this, and a brochure or advertisement. We're gonna go with Pan Am. 
and then add a couple circles here and there. Okay, we gotta get it all to fit on somehow. Might be interesting to cut this out. Yeah, I didn't go out to lunch yesterday with the ladies because of the dog's schedule got me. And my sister and I were going to go up to the museum in Greenville today because we've been trying to do something. And she has a couple days off because she has to use up vacation. And like, ah, because one of the football games was up there. And I do not want to go where there was 75,000 people in a football stadium with no masks. <laughs> This past weekend. Nope, 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 nope. And she's like, I know. And it was it was a museum, so it's inside. And she needs to get out and do something. I need to get out and do something. But we, I said, you know. Hello, little dog. I hear you in here. Okay. I might put these down this. These are the ones that just kept falling out, begging to be used. Although, it's going to cover up the maroon aspect. I'm going to cut this out too. This came up under Pinterest under some weird building search. <laughs> well, it's some weird building that looks like the face is carved in it. And who knows, it may not be in Europe. I quite often get my things wrong. After all, I thought this lady that made this book was in Europe somewhere. She's in California. Remember that one, Curti? Yeah. I want some of this to show because I love this paper here. In fact, I might do this. <gasps> Sienna! Tiles from Sienna! I've been there. And Bologna, I've been there. And Florence, I've been there. Huh, I don't want any of this covered. Can we squish it all down into here? I'm ready to go again. I think I'm going to do this. And just cut out Pan Am. I'm so ready to go, but not with all the crazy. Luca, that's where my grandfather was from. Not what, oh, graph paper. Hmm. Not with all the crazy numbers. I don't want to cover all this up. And I have this thing about everything has to touch, which is not required. Yeah, our humidity is way back, which is normal. Last week when we had those nice days, it was that was very abnormal. It's not very straight. It's hard to tell.
but yes, this book has helped me get out of my slump, which has been very nice. Because I do think I was just over even though I do do this every day. Hello. I think I just kind of got in a funk. Hello. I see you down there. Hello. <laughs> Hello. I see you. Hello. You want to do art? Okay. Do you want to do art? Oh, there's Paris in here too. I just don't want to cover up that thing. This design, hardly. Come here. Where'd you go? Hello. Hello, little boy. Hello, pretty boy. Not as pretty, huh? They cut off all your hair. Said I got my hair cut off. Or as people in the South say, you got your ears lowered. <laughs> it's a good thing I caught you. It's a good thing I caught you. Okay. And they still smells like perfume. Oh, I hate when they do that. No. Now what? You just went for a walk. We just took you for a walk. No, quit trying to eat my stickers. Quit trying to eat my stickers. Gunner. No, no. We put his new name tag on here last night. Nope. Not having any of that. Take this thing off. <laughs> He's such a brat. Okay. That's it for today. Enough to get my juices going. But I'm not caught up quite yet. I have one. Two. Ah, 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 ah. Bring that book back. Gunner. Nope. Sometimes you need gang pa paper, which works perfectly, except he just stole my book. Okay, one, so now he's back to the stack to get another one. One, two, three, four, five. Got her? Now he's stealing Audrey Hepburn. You can't have her. Get here. Get that, you little brat. Where'd you put it? you off here. Now you can't get to the books. <laughs> Trying to steal her. <laughs> Jeez Louise. I don't know. I have probably eight to go. And Friday is my one year anniversary of my foot. <laughs> and I think I'm going to try to go under the house on that day. Oh, now... Goodbye. Have a good day. Thanks for watching.